Hey there! If you clicked on this video, you either have really bad relationship with your partner and you want to break things off, but because you have no guts to do it, you're looking for creative ways to do it without being an asshole while being an asshole, or you have no life. In any case, welcome back. I don't know why, but I hate saying that. Like, that welcome back sounds so fucking unnatural. Like, you wouldn't say it to your friend if they came to your house, you wouldn't be like, oh, hey there. Welcome back to my house. Today, we're gonna watch Netflix and eat nuggets. Like, no one would say that. That sounds fucking cringe. I, I don't know. Just let me know if you like me saying that. Like, so I would, I would be relieved. You know, I wouldn't overthink it a lot. But today, as you can see from the title, we will be looking at the worst possible presents you can give to your loved ones. And if you give them, you probably hate them. So just... Let's just jump into it. So I want to start off the video with my uh, personal favorite, which is a basket full of diet products. And you know, I, I feel like there's just no excuse. Like you cannot make this gift work in any case. It's just basically calling your partner a whale. Like saying that, hey babe, hey, babe. I, love I love you. you. But you kind of got fat. You're like You're chunky. Like chunky. You're, like, You're big. like big. Like a bit like whale. whale. Like you were like a, you shark, a shark, and now you and got, got you turned into a whale. whale. And I'm not and into I'm not whales. Into whales. I, know I know there are a lot of fish, fish in the sea, but, but I'm not, not into whales. whales. That was awful. I don't know what Jackson would try to do. That was awful. That would... I don't know. I don't know. But if I got a basket full of diet products from my partner, I would be pretty offended but you know that diet products are expensive as hell like they're overpriced so i would probably eat all of them and then dump him so my love for you is like diarrhea i just cannot hold it in oh this is that this is what i mean when i say that girls love romance it's just it's just a full package you know the fact that there is a heart shape on the toilet paper, you know, I, I the, the one thing that really kind of bothers me is if that color comes off when you wipe your butt, I don't know, but it's just so romantic. I feel like it's it's everything that you need in your life. And if this gift was given um, in last February, like in 2020s February, when everyone was looking for toilet paper, when it was like such an expensive thing because everyone was going crazy and just stealing all the toilet paper, I think this one would freaking smash it dude tongue scrapers for him and her and i feel like this gift because it is for both of them it, sh it wouldn't be that offensive it would be just like him or her admitting that they have really stinky breath so they should definitely get a tongue scraper and what bothers me like the only thing that bothers me in this gift is that i never knew that our tongue had a fur like i never knew that we had furry tongues like what the fuck that's kind of gross like do i need to shave my tongue worst driver ever but cute no don't call don't freaking insult me then call me cute and it's the the, the fact that worst driver ever is written in like big caps and but cute is written like tiny 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 letters it just makes me it just makes me think that this person really meant it like they really meant that you are an awful driver and me as a person who has really bad vision i would probably not see the butt cute part and i would think that my partner just hates me and just thinks i'm an awful driver and you know the gifts like this i have no problem with these besides the fact that it's like being an asshole to your partner and then giving them gifts to make it up you know those pranks that you see on youtube that are really uncomfortable to watch it just reminds me of that i don't know Maybe I'm just a boomer. Stick with me. Beautiful. I think it's beautiful. Hands free cell phone kit. <laughs> so this one is definitely my favorite. Like this is the top gift that you should definitely give to your partner. Like I think this is probably better than getting someone an iPhone 12 or a new laptop because it's so handy. Like when you, when you think about it, when you drive a car or when you're, I don't know, just like walking, 
you're too lazy to pick up your phone and just answer it you know it'd be good if it was just like glued on your ear and you wouldn't have to do anything you know it's just freaking genius life without you is um bearable so creative so so creative i have no words this is cute this is cheap this is delicious and I love the minimum effort that this person put in the present. You know, that's that's how we're doing it in 2021. I love me more. Yes, girl or boy. Get it. Love yourself. Fuck your partner. Who cares? You should love yourself more. You should always put yourself more. Well, actually you should, but also maybe you shouldn't give someone a gift telling that you love yourself more than them which can be kind of rude, I don't know. But you can still eat it. I don't know what that is. is. Is it a cake? If it's a cake, I wouldn't be mad. I would eat it, you know, who cares? It can look messy, but I will still eat it because it's, it, it's delicious, so. I am nuts about you. No comment. You are not the worst. You know, I, if I ever get into a relationship, I just hope that I will get these sentences these comments from my partner because it's just so wholesome you know it's like so heartwarming to hear that you're just not perfect you know they they just want to keep their partners humble and let them know that you're not perfect but you don't suck either like you're just you're a mediocre you're like average you're maybe a bit below average but you're definitely not up so if you ever think of dumping me remember this candle also by the way this is a freaking candle like i thought it was a peanut butter and i was okay with that because you know it's still food who cares if there's some weird shit written on it if you can eat it but you can't even eat it and you have to burn it and you will probably see it for like a really long time in your room every time you look at it you will remember that you kind of suck so i don't know love is a battlefield really deep and I do agree, it is a battlefield. That's why you literally bought a figure that has a gun that's shooting. So basically what I get from this is that you have to shoot your partner if they just, you know, get on your nerves because the battlefield, you know, you're like, you're rivals. You're not in the same team, you're in opposite teams and you should shoot your partner if they eat your candy or your food or just step on your shoes. You should just like, just pull the trigger. And what, also confuses me about this one is that it's just nothing makes sense you know if if you bought a figure that has a gun like they're holding a gun why would you tape why would you use a glittery tape and i don't know if it's from a girl or a boy because the tape is glittery and it makes me think it's not from a boy but again i don't want to be sexist so maybe it's a boy who likes glitter no judgment but it's just nothing makes sense so i hate everyone you will not as much. You know, I feel like if I got this gift, I would just feel so special because, you know, it's just, you are different. You're not like other girls or you're not like other boys' wives. And I like it, you know? I would feel like I'm just, I'm just a freaking alien and I'm not a person. And that's why he or she literally hates everybody but me because I'm just so unique. I can't wait for our love to grow. First of all, why would you not get like a real plant and you would get like a fake, that's, what is that even? I think that's supposed to be a candy, but that really looks like a bath bomb. I just cannot tell if that's a soap bath bomb or an actual candy. It just looks really unappetizing. Like I, I don't think I would eat it. And why would you put a fake leaf carton leaf and write i can't wait for our love to grow that's just that doesn't make sense like you could really get a plant and maybe cut it in heart shape or maybe just get a plant that would make sense like it's not gonna grow you're just gonna eat it or maybe wash your hands with it or take a bath in it i love the shit out of you so cute and so stinky the combination of the everything that you need in a present also it's useful i love when people give me gifts that i can use so 10 out of 10. you know i don't have anything to say about this one like i'm just speechless and i think it's genius i i i think it's genius i think it is delicious and i think it's 
weird, but also pretty, but also weird, like why? But also kind of yummy. But also if you give it to your girlfriend or boyfriend who is vegetarian, they will probably hate it. So I would say it's very individual gift. We tried. Like I wish you I wish you didn't try because it really hurt my freaking heart. Like it it crushed my soul because they literally took a bite. Like who can is that I, I'm pretty sure they took a bite. Am I wrong? Is it cooked like that? Or did they really are they really bad at art? I just refuse to believe that someone is that bad at shaping a doll. That's so easy to do. And I just think they just took a bite and ruined the whole pizza. In any case, it just looks like... It looks like the pizza went bald. Like, pizza literally lost all his pepperoni. And it's just bald. I'm heartbroken. Okay, guys, that's it for today's video. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you hated it, Turn your phone upside down and give it a thumbs down while your phone is upside down. Trust me, that will satisfy both you and me. You know, that will be beneficial for both you and me. But other than that, don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see more awful content uh, on your timeline. And also turn on your notification bell so you would get notification in the middle of your sleep. So you should wake up and watch my video, then go back to sleep. So you can sleep better. Or have nightmares. Anyway, bye.